Hi, it's Cassie with Cassie's Parlor. Today we're going to make a fun hot cocoa pouch that you can use to give as a gift. Uh, I thought that this might be a fun thing to do since it's getting chilly outside. You could use it for the holidays or even just for winter time. So I have the Stampin' Die set that has the um, gingerbread and the hot chocolate cup, whipped cream, and marshmallows. Super cute stuff here. It's got the die and the stamp set with it from the Maker's Movement. And here I'm using the crossover too just to cut out all those pieces. And you notice that I, I got to cut them all out at the same time with different kinds of paper because that platform is nice and big. So I have room for everything all at once. So I wanted um, three of those marshmallows just so I'd have some to play with. So I ran that back through with just the marshmallow. And you'll notice I folded that paper so I was able to cut multiples there because that machine is so strong. So then I have some craft paper and I've just gusseted the bottom and scored it so that it um, has a little bit more dimension. And then really this is like, the super simplest project you'll ever make uh, but it's really really pretty and super fun with this great stamp and die set so I've put the um, the cup onto that base and then I'm just uh, stamping the uh, gingerbread man I've used some brown ink for him and then I'm going back over him with black ink just so I can cut out the um, the bow tie out of that green glitter cardstock uh, and then I'm gonna glue that right onto our gingerbread man. I really think that adding some of these small details really helps to finish a project and make it extra special. So then I'm just going to use an acrylic paint pen in white to color the hands and feet of that little gingerbread man and look at him. He's so adorable. I love it. Um, so then I also wanted to stamp some more details onto that straw. So this straw stamp has some lines in it and we will color those. Um, but I'm also going to stamp the, um, the marshmallows and you'll notice uh, they have the cutest little faces. They have little smiles and um, they're adorable. So there's two different styles of the marshmallow there, but I've I've stamped three of them just um, just so I could have some to play with. And then you'll see I'm using that same paint pen um, just to add some of the stripes in that um, that straw just to give it a little bit more personality. I'm using double stick tape. This is really strong tape and I'm using this because um, over my tape runner because it's extra strong and when you're working on glitter paper I've noticed that for me at least I need a really strong adhesive just to make sure that those pieces are going to stay in place long term and they're not going to fall off eventually. Because generally um, glitter paper is coated uh, so it just needs a little bit extra um, adhesive. So I'm using that for all of these pieces to stick down and it works really really well. I've added the gingerbread man and the marshmallows in front of the cup and I'm just using that same adhesive to adhere the um, the packet of hot chocolate. Now you could add another packet of like clear uh, you know sandwich bag kind of thing with uh, marshmallows in it or chocolate chips or something like that You could really dress this up. You could even put sprinkles You know you could make it as as fancy or as simple as you want think about you know Maybe not this year, but in the future a holiday party or a kids school party um, Where you could make a bunch of these up ahead of time you know, and just sit down in one afternoon and make a bunch of them, especially if you're using the crossover too. You can cut multiple pieces of paper at once, so you've got them all cut out and ready to go, and then you're just assembling. I've added just a nice ribbon bow at the top, and it's super simple. You could put a message on the back, say Merry Christmas or Happy Holidays, whatever you like. I hope that you enjoyed this project. This was really quick and easy and fun to make. Super cute stamps there, and a really fun gift for the holiday season. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.